All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Heavenly Delusion episode five. In the last episode, of uh, kind of focusing more on the children's place, school, prison um, kind of side of the story. Uh, we had Tokyo and her froggy friend, well, let's just call her Froppy, um, who were kind of exploring the this uh, place that they are in. Uh, Froppy said that, hey, do you want to come see, see some babies? Uh, they don't have faces. Turns out it's freaking money is that they're growing there. And they ended up, well, they almost got caught twice. They would have been caught if for not the fact that the cameras were being hacked or something like that. My theory was that the AI or something that runs this place um, is helping them, maybe? I don't know. We'll see. Or maybe it could be someone's power. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, the little, little baby Manny ended up recognizing her name as well. Crazy. Could be that they're taking Manny to powers, making them put them into children or vice versa. I have no idea. But I'm very excited to find out. So as always, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. 400,000. Is it going to play after like 20 years though? Oh. Look how they still got stuff like this working in this world. What's your beef? It's like a bunch of adults just fucking around with a kid. You break my game, I'll fuck you up. Wasn't one whack enough? He grabbed my head. These adults are pussies, bro. I hope he fucks them all up. He knocked out a tooth? Nah, you're getting fucked up. Yes! Let's go, Maru. Yeah! Kitty cool kick! Bro, if my friend's fighting, I'm fighting too. What do you mean? <laughs> it's not... Oh, they didn't just knock it out. It actually broke off. Ow. The same year as the Great Disaster. Maybe that's why he has his powers. It's nice that in this world there were still people that would take care of the kids. Like, we went with the killer. That's wild. Wait, so this person could do that as well, or...? The next person I had to listen to. Wow. Damn. Yeah, makes sense. Burn any books that seem useful after reading them. Why? Oh, okay. Interesting. And you got a knocked out tooth. Yeah, because they'll recognize you. So he, only he could do it. Yeah, she taught him how to do it. Interesting. <laughs> one of them's going to recognize her. Actually, that guy. One of the guys there, I think it is. Yeah, abducting them. Jeez. <laughs> We're roasting her. One-on-one? -on -one? They'll still beat your ass. Because he's your friend. Why is the door open? They didn't find... They didn't find him, did they? Oh, shit. Where's he gone? Yeah! Can you tell me where you gone, please? What are you hiding in there, boy? You were looking at porn? Remember, this is a dude, Maru. He understands. Oh, he was, she was really freaking out right there. Didn't want to be alone. Oh, Oh, kitty go. Kind of. Well... 
everybody has their own problems, but she he kind of went through hell. This boy. <laughs> God damn it. Robots to make life easier. Yeah, basically. What the hell did they eat? Like a fucking crow or something? Why does it feel like a foreshadowing or something? Restored, or maybe it was always like this. Ah, oh, shit, the boot mark. These weird ass instruments. Do they all have the same shoes? Or. Oh, shit. Boy, what are you doing? The kid in the bed could throw that rock? Jeez. It's. I think it's the kid in the bed that they're talking about, right? Did he die? Well. That's one way to announce that. Jesus, you could be a bit more subtle. Oof. Bro got him in the goddamn Hell's Paradise setup. Where does this disease even come from? Like, this, this not a contained environment? Where does it come from? Oh my god. This shit is gruesome. So it's not overly common. Does the, the 12 there, and it was 17 before, does that mean it was five years ago? Within a body built with an immunity to everything. Oh shit. I can't figure out if these are good people or bad people. They're probably bad people, but they have some good tendencies, maybe? And then just a random switch back to these two. The taste and how clear it looks. Who the hell is this? Someone is pulling up. Get the gun. How do they know where we are? Okay, that's a good sign. Was this the captain or just a random person? Get random side quests here. What kind of doctor? Yeah? You can have a monster part put in you? Jesus. That probably smells like ass. Do not... Is he going to eat it? Well, that sucks. Strange people. <laughs> going to kill this old woman. Is there something in his bones? What is it? What the fuck is that? Right, so that was Heavenly Delusion Episode 5. We are in SideQuest City right now, um, beating up random gangs and doing random... Well, almost did a random side quest, but that, that didn't really go through, did it? Um, yeah, this it's very interesting now still. <laughs> we know next to nothing, but like bit by bit, Kiriko and Mario are making their way through the world, potentially get, eventually get into this heaven, which presumably is where these kids are. But now they've mentioned, again, like, uh, if you get a part of a man here uh, put into your body, you'll become immortal and maybe have some kind of power. So that definitely links to the possibility that this is what's happened to the kids. However, then, whatever this was at the end of the episode with the adults, when they cremated Taro's body and there's some kind of thing in it, it maybe that was his heart, but it's been in, kind of encased in something. Like, maybe this disease did that? I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, overall, a very good episode. I'm definitely looking forward to the next. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.